This video is based on the poor data validation. Before going to the definition poor data validation, just read the instruction in the provided by this website. Here, to get the result key to this lesson, you must bypass the validation in the following function and submit a negative number. So, if we give a negative number, this should be bypassed. So, here when we are clicking this submit number and an error occurred invalid number, number must be greater than 0. We can bypass this, bypass this one by giving negative number, but the validation is given it can be greater than zero that means it must be a positive number here you can see when we are clicking this one it's a valid number submitted so we need to give a negative number in order to bypass this one so then let's see what is a poor data validation here you can see the description of the poor data validation in the web website as the security weakness is the failure to properly validate the input from the client or environment that the website is very poor in the validation part which is which is entered by the user so this weakness led to almost all major vulnerabilities in applications such as interpreter injection local or unicode attack file system attack and buffer overflow these are some attacks which can be done by the attackers in order to having the vulnerability of the poor data validation so same as the previous insecure direct object reference we have need to use the verb suit tool in order to catch the traffic so here open the verb suit tool and intercept on the intercept to catch the traffic and then give a positive number then only the packet will be redirected then submit the number here you can see the verb suit catch the packet and you can see this user data is one here the thing is we have need to change this user data into a minus number in order to bypass the validation after change this as in minus one we have need to forward this packet and let's see what happened to the website yeah here the server responded with the result key to us then copied it to paste in the in this text box and submit it the thing is is again we have need to stop the intersection because it's stop and collect and analyzes each packets in every time so here you can see the solution submission successfully so this is what we did is we got the packet and we changed the value we entered into a negative number that means we are here we are bypassing the client side validation if we are entering a number positive negative number then this the website is not allowing to enter the negative number so but the case is we have need to bypass it the validation by using the verb suit too so we will see on the next video thank you